Alright, so this video is just to clarify some of the discussion I've been uh, having with some people on the, the DeviantArt website. So this program is called Scribbles that I'm basically showing. This is a quick sketch that I did. And what I want to do at this point is I want to add some... Uh, I want to start doing some fine lining. You can see this is relatively rough. So I'm going to just, you know, start doing some of the, you know, some of the detailing around the eye and stuff. And now at this point, all right, so I, so I got the outside of the eye and, and so forth. All right, I'm not going to get too held up, you know, really doing the fine lining of this. But what I want to do is I want to show you basically, I want to go into that eye and I want to get, I want to give the pupil some, some, some good detail. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom in. And as you see, as I zoom in, you don't see any pixels. This is what I've been trying to communicate with with people on, with everyone on the site. This, this program just does not show pixels because everything in the when when you draw something, you use a stroke rendering a, a back end engine. And when you that that basically means when you when you zoom in, it's always going to re render everything and show you everything. But you're not working with bezier curves or anything like that. So basically, you can see even at this level. See the pressure sensitivity on my Wacom like that's what it's giving you at that level and you see there's no pixels so that's that's the whole thing that I'm trying to that I'm trying to really really nail down on is that there's absolutely no pixels inside this program that that you'll ever need to experience and how is it helpful well when you're drawing something you don't have to be bound by the canvas size um, when you are uh, when you want to draw something, you know, a lot of times if you're using a raster-based program or a pixel-based program, like Photoshop, Corel, or, um, well, let me be more specific, like Paint Painter, uh, you know, your, your canvas, you're basically drawing for a set size. So with this kind of program, you really don't have that. Um, you don't have to have that in the back of your mind, like, what size am I going to be drawing this? So, you know, it's... It's a kind of like a. It's a very different approach, and it, it to me it gives me a little bit more flexibility because I never need to worry about that when I start drawing. I just start drawing, and then, you know, if I need to put more detail on, I just zoom in. And like I, like, you know, like I said before, you could just keep zooming in and zooming in, and you're just not going to see, you know, pixels. So, I mean, that's just that's the power of this program. And, you know, I hope, I hope I was able to communicate that, you know, this time around compared to, you know, I guess it's so much easier, too, to show something, you know, visually than showing it, you know, or trying to explain it in text. So, alrighty.